Hey gang, it's Koji and I'm just now coming back from the store. Had to get myself some ponzu sauce for today's project. It's kind of windy out here, so let me get inside and we'll get started. You said let's jump on the bus and take a ride downtown Well I don't know about that But can you help me first to get these boxes down Well I don't know about that Alright, so why ponzu sauce you may be asking Well, a quick story There's this Hole in the wall, a true mom and pop shop that I absolutely love going to. Right in town, it's called Hidechan's, and they make really great home cooking. I mean, there's nothing better than home cooking, but they're pretty good. So they make uh, great Japanese and Okinawan dishes, but it's funny because my favorite dish there, and I've been going there for like 15 years now, maybe even longer, but my favorite dish there is a hamburger wafu style and it's this regular hamburger patty that they cover with ground um, daikon radish and top it with some radish sprouts uh, with a bed of bean sprouts and what ties everything together you guessed it the ponzu sauce and so that's what I'm going to try to recreate today is that hamburger dish uh, and using the ponzu sauce. So that's what this is here for. All right, let's try it out, shall we? Okay, so step one. Gotta wash all your produce, regardless of where it comes from. Always wash your produce. Okay, now it's time for the hamburger and at this point you can use whatever hamburger recipe that you have and for me it's just ground beef um, I'm gonna do some minced garlic some onions and I'm gonna throw in some little bit of salt and pepper to flavor a couple of eggs and we're gonna be good to go oh breadcrumbs too yeah and then we're gonna be good to go whatever you have Hey gang, I know I have a bowl down here somewhere. Okay, I think this will have to do. Okay, so today to make our hamburger, we're gonna be using the Tupperware Micro Pro Grill. And I just so happen to have a micro version of the Micro Pro Grill. You see what I did there? Micro. Anyway, the Tupperware Micro Pro Grill is two pieces. Basically, it has a top and a bottom. What happens in the microwave is the microwaves do not cook your food. What it's doing is it's heating up the two plates, the plate on the top and the plate on the bottom. And those heated plates is what's gonna be doing all the cooking action today. So we're gonna put our hamburger patty as well as our bean sprouts into the micro pro grill, stick it in the microwave for about three to five minutes. I'm thinking it's gonna be more towards five minutes. And when it comes out, it should be sizzling and ready to serve. Let's try it out. Okay. 
Okay, so now that the hamburger is cooking, it's time to get the daikon ready. Here we go. Here it is. Hamburger waffle style. And now all I need is my ponzu sauce, just like that. And I have my little dish here. Mmm. Yeah. That's that's exactly what I need. You're probably wondering, you're gonna eat this with a fork? Don't you normally eat this with a chopstick or something? Yeah, I do. But I don't have a chopstick right now. Oh. And you know what's really nice is the hamburger is still very moist. So, and the daikon and the ponzu sauce together. Sorry, you can't see it. My, uh, hold on, let me bring this here. Check it out. Mm. Okay. Mm. Just like at the restaurant. But I gotta tell you, there's something special when they make it. So it's like a special sauce or a special ingredient. But this comes pretty damn close. I'm really happy and I will see you next time. Peace. It would probably work better if I had the blade inside. <laughs> ah.